Well, Victor, it's a little too dark. I got out here, I met Dan kind of late. He had meetings all day. But this is what we're looking at. We're just going to take two of the best limbs up over the top of the stump. You know, like we do. And uh, we'll just graft on two. We don't need all those limbs. We'll graft on this one and this one. And probably put eight sticks on there and he'll have plenty of buds to come out and replace these limbs. But I told him don't cut them that short. He shouldn't cut them in the fall. He really should cut them in the spring. So I had him leave, leave the rest of them like this. They're real tall. Um, because two things, if you cut them in the fall, that bark's gonna tighten up and the bark won't slip. It'll, about, it'll be about two weeks later in the spring before it slips over a tree that you cut two weeks before you're gonna graft it. They'll slip right away. But these will tighten up. And the other risk, the risk is that if we have a hard freeze, it'll go right down into that stump. And I don't know if you remember, Victor, but we were in Walla Walla grafting one time and going down the row and everything was fine. And then we crossed a little drive, driveway, a little drive road. And then all of a sudden the cambium was just black inside. When we lift the bark, the cambium was black and we had to stop. And I asked the guy, what's the difference? He said, well, these good ones that you're grafting, we cut about two weeks ago. The ones where the cambium is dead, we cut last fall. And then over the winter, they had a hard freeze. So that's the risk of cutting trees in the fall. If you wait till spring, you don't have that danger. Uh, I mean, that had to be a pretty hard freeze, but the trees that uh, he'd left and intact and hadn't cut anything, they were just fine and they grew, no problems. But so he said, well, we should have talked to you before I done that. I go, yeah. You should always talk to, talk to your grafter before you cut the trees down. But uh, hopefully we'll be okay. Hopefully we'll get away with it. Hopefully he will get away with it. And uh, he wasn't going to graft these old goldens, but I think we're going to try and graft a few of them where they're tall enough, depending on what kind of shape they're in after, after we get through the winter. We'll make a decision. Anyway, it's a little dark, but I wanted you to get an idea, Victor. We've got about... 640 trees out here to do and uh, we'll get a for sure count on it i told him to have jorge get the wood because he knows what to do so we'll go from there all right talk to you later